Hello and welcome to a new reaction video. My name is Larissa and it's time. House of the Dragon has finally dropped the first teaser for season two. So probably a lot of you saw this reaction coming already, but uh, yeah, here I am. It's been a while since season one came out. Um, and of course we had the strikes in the meantime, so they couldn't film and all. Uh, but now it's finally going again and uh, it's coming in the beginning of the summer, I believe, from 2024. Um, I am kind of hoping we're gonna get a date in this teaser because they're constantly like summer, beginning summer. And I'm like, yeah, what do you mean with that? I suppose like June. But yeah, I need to know because, you know, I have to make an appointment with the hairdresser. You gotta be full Targaryen for that shit. But yeah, it's a really short teaser. It's only one minute and 25 seconds. I don't know how much information we're gonna get. Um, I also want to inform you that I have decided to not continue reading the book. I'm just gonna watch the show and go into it blindly. As some of you know, I started reading the book right before the first season came out. And I think I got to like one fourth of the book actually and then so many people were saying like it's so much more fun if you just watch the show without having that read the book so yeah i i know some things but uh i don't know everything so i think that's gonna be fun um yeah enough talking it's only a short teaser let's watch the teaser errors were made in the hours following king Viserys's death oh Many will die. And the victor will eventually ascend the throne. There is no war so hateful to the gods. There's a war between kin. Oh my god, this looks so cool. Ah, oh, it still says summer 2024, but holy shit. That was good. You know how like normally teasers are so short and don't say anything? I feel like we've seen so much in this small teaser. Okay, I'm gonna analyze it a little bit. Um, it's a lot, so not everything, but I'm gonna scroll through it. The first thing we see is Renera, who is probably still mourning her son's death. I still can get over that. That was so messed up, the way he was killed. And it was just like, after that episode ended, I remember just... I kept thinking about it. I just couldn't like... I don't have anything with children. I don't care about children, but that was messed up. And honestly, I really liked that boy. He was so cute and he was so nice. And I felt like he was really one of the nicest characters, you know, he was just genuinely nice. It does make for a very good story though. <laughs> So yeah, Renera is definitely not amused right now. And yeah, I mean, that was really the last drop to starting a war, I think. So yeah. Uh, then we have Aegon uh, walking towards the throne, sitting on the throne eventually even. I also don't like that. <laughs> I mean, obviously it was gonna happen, but I don't like seeing it, you know. Then we have Damon, love for Damon. Then we have, I think, the banners from uh, House Hightower. I think they're marching to King's Landing, and I think they're, yeah, they're gonna take over now. Uh, some war shots. Alison talking about the war, like many will die. Like this is gonna be a really heavy war. And then we saw Tristan. I'm, I'm honestly like forgetting some of the names. This is hard. I think everyone kind of hates him, so who cares? I really liked him in the first few episodes. Like in the past, he was so nice, and then. Yeah, he just became an asshole. He's beheading someone. And, oh, I also see here, like, the armor from, from these um, guards. It has the golden Targaryen sign. And I have been told that the golden Targaryen sign is, like, uh, Aemon's Targaryen sign. I have this one shirt with the golden Targaryen sign. And I was wearing it one time in a reaction. And then people are like, why are you wearing the sign from Aemon? I thought you were Team Rhaenyra. But I had no idea. So in that way you can really say, see like, oh yeah, they have really taken over. Um, Renara being beautiful as ever. I, I have like the crown she has. I have it in a ring. Oh, it's so bright, you can't, the light. <laughs> but like this is the crown, the Targaryen crown. I think it's really cool. I really like it. Um, yeah, they're mostly just talking about the war. Um, 
Aemond. Oh, Aemond looking at the Iron Throne. I think I missed that. Is it? Yeah, he's looking at the Iron Throne. Ooh, <laughs> it's gonna be drama. And this shot from um, Alicent. And during that shot, I think you heard her say like, there's nothing as like brutal as a war between kin or something like that. And seeing her like that, I feel like she does kind of feel bad in some way. So she's feeling some guilt maybe. Oh, this is the shot where I went crazy. Like... I don't know, this was just so cool. And I think that's Renera and he's so far away. I can't even see his color. I think it's green. I have a feeling like it's Aemond or something because Aemond killed her son. So is that Vigor like the, the, the green dragon? No, Vigor's way bigger, right? Oh, but he is really big. Yeah, I think it is actually then. Then we have the conversation between Renera and um, Rennes. And I think it's good to see that Rennes is really like on her side right now because in the first season, I feel like we never really knew for sure like... Rannis, of course, was actually the rightful queen. Um, so that's why I was like, yeah, she's never gonna support Renera. But now the choice is Renera or Aegon. And I think that's a pretty easy choice, actually. <laughs> I think we also had a shot of, like, the daughter from Alicent. I don't know if this was a spoiler. I think it was. I think something bad was gonna happen to her, but I don't really know what. So, I mean, then I guess I'm still not spoiled. I mean, bad things happen to literally everyone right here, so. This is Bela, right? Oh, this shot on the dragon. Oh, the shots on the dragons. The shot with the... Oh, this... I am so excited for season two. I feel like I'm kind of overanalyzing it right now, but you never can never analyze enough. Teasers are so small, you gotta look at every picture to like know what's happening. I think I kind of got the overall view now. Like all I can say is I'm really excited. I think it was such a good teaser. Like it actually said something. Like I said before, most times teasers don't say anything and I'm just like, ah, yeah, okay, I guess. I gotta say it is exactly what I expected. I haven't seen anything where I was like, oh my God, I didn't see that coming. I mean, we all know how season one ended. Um, especially if you've read the book, you know what's gonna happen, but like, yeah, I just imagined Renera being pissed. Also, Alison misunderstood the whole thing from, from Viserys when he died and that's gonna lead to a war. And that's basically what we're seeing right now. I think. If I have to choose between like all the things what, that are going on, the thing I am most excited for is um, Renara maybe having a confrontation with Aemond because of her son, you know? Um, and also maybe Renara and Allison seeing each other again. I don't know. It's gonna be bad. It's gonna be messed up. This whole show is gonna be messed up. I think season one, I feel like it was such a slow build towards what's going on now but i think it was so interesting i really heard people say like oh i didn't really like house of the dragon because it was too much politics and i was like dude this is the whole build up to the war that's coming right now i can't see how people don't think that's so interesting i am so excited for season two and i think everyone who's watching is as well so uh yeah let me know in the comments what you thought of the trailer if i missed something if i said a name wrong if i wasn't right about something please just let me know like i said before i haven't read the books i know everything about game of thrones but the history parts just like bits and pieces and i want to keep it that way just to like yeah not get spoiled for house of the dragon be more shocked when things happen i made that choice for myself right now and i want to read the book sometimes but um yeah i think when season two or like when the show has ended so yeah thank you so much for watching like i said let me know what you thought of the trailer and make sure to check out my patreon where you can get early access to my videos and also when house of the dragon comes out you can watch my full reactions on there if you like this video then please leave a like subscribe and then i really hope to see you next time bye